Hi everyone, here I am doing exercise 10.3 fifth question, chapter is mensuration of class 6. Question is, what is the cost of tiling a rectangular plot of land 500 meter long and 200 meter wide at a rate of rupees 8 per 100 square meter. Now what is given here, we have given that there is a plot which is in shape of rectangle and the length is 500 meter, width is 200 meter and we have to find out the cost where they are charging per 100 meter square it is 8 rupees means for 100 meter square it is 8 rupees first we're going to find out the area and then later we're going to find out the cost so let us write down what is given in the question so what is given here so they have given length and breadth of the plot so length is equal to 500 meter and breadth is equal to 200 meter we have to find out the first uh, area of the land so area will become area of land is equal to its length into breadth because the shape is rectangle the formula will be length into breadth let's substitute the value so length is 500 and breadth is 200 so 5 into 2 is 10 and followed by 4 zeros so when you multiply here you actually get a 1 lakh so this is 1 lakh meter square this is a area we got now we have to find out the cost if you see here they are charging per 100 meter square means for 100 meter square they are charging rupees 8 so here we got 1 lakh meter square first we have to find out how many 100 meter square are there in 1 lakh and after that we have to multiply with 8 that is the cost so first we're going to find out this so we're going to how we're going to get how many hundreds are there in 1 lakh we're going to divide it so therefore cost of tiling will be equal to so first i'm going to divide 1 lakh by 100 and i said after dividing we're going to multiply with 8 because that is a cost i hope you understood why i'm dividing here because they are charging per 100 meter square means for 100 meter square it is 8 rupees so i don't know how many hundreds are there in this that is why we're dividing here with 100 and and then we're going to multiply with 8 which i have already multiplied here with 8 okay you can divide and you can get the answer and you can multiply here i'm doing directly all together so I'm going to cancel this. So two zeros will get cancelled in the numerator and denominator. This is equal to 1000 multiplied by 8 which is equal to 8000. So the total cost will be rupees 8000. So this was easy question. I hope it is clear. In case you have any other question or doubt, you can drop a comment below. And if you want a more solution from this exercise, you can visit a playlist. Thank you so much for watching.